Today we are going to take a look at Java SWT testing. I started Squish already, created a test suite and a test case, so I'm ready for the recording. I'm using the SWT address book example, which is available in every Squish for Java package. I'm now interacting with the application. In particular, I'm loading a file which contains sample data for the address book. I have a bunch of entries in my table right now, but is something missing or is the number of entries correct? Let's create a verification point for that. The IDE is now in the spy mode, which allows me to analyze the structure of the application. The application objects view shows that I have directly access to the SWT components. I could search for the table object manually in the tree structure of the application objects view or use the green pipette to directly get all information to the table. On the right side we see all properties for the previously picked table. In particular I'm looking for item count. To create the verification point it's necessary to enable the checkbox. Afterwards click on save and insert verification. The script is shown after the recording is stopped. 125 entries were successfully imported during the record. Let's save this number into a variable and use this in the script. Let's rerun the script and see if this still works and if 125 entries are imported again. The result shows that the verification point passes, which means that the data was imported correctly. To create a failing verification point, I'm changing the number to 124 and rerun the script again. Squish performs the actions as fast as possible. That's why we do not see that much. But as expected, the verification point is failing. Thanks for watching. If you have further questions, get in touch with us by writing an email to squish at froglogic.com. You can check out Squish on your own by requesting a free trial. You might also be interested in our second product, Coco, which is a multi-language coach coverage tool. Don't forget to check out our YouTube channel for more videos. Bye bye.